wherein we would want to know your professional background and we want to understand your experience as our CWM student. CWM okay. is so most of my it was SBI your first job, job, or you have also done any job before that? The SBI is my first job. Great. So since the beginning of your career, you are with SBI Bank and you spent risk 15 years in the bank and you have opted to do this program, but they don't want to learn something extra. So you have a perfect example that, you know, you took up a private certification. Okay. So when you uh, thought of doing it, what are the other certification or the qualification you already had before this program? No, I didn't have, um, when I happened to be in wealth management, when SBI, when it launched in 2015, it was the first of its kind of experience for me when the bank started in the field of wealth management. So I came to know about, know much about this wealth management program, AFM certifications. And then I decided to go for this program to equip me better, to excel myself better in this. So but the curriculum that you had studied in Chartered Wealth Manager, do you think the curriculum was uh, enough for anyone to succeed in wealth management, to understand, understand this department as a wealth management, as a whole, basically, in wealth management? A from offers to the aspirants. And what do you think, what is the scope of wealth management in banking? Why people need to study wealth management? People think that, you know, they, are, they don't, I mean, they don't understand till now. They are not very clear with the scope of wealth management in banking segment. If you can throw some more light on wealth management part of banking. Sure. So wealth management is an evolving concept as far as the Indian uh, scenario is concerned. In foreign countries, it is already established, but in the Indian, Indian economic scenario, wealth management is just evolving. So that is why we are all late entrants to this field. Our, our private sector counterparts had already entered uh, before um, the public sector enterprises came into the space. So uh, regarding the scope of this segment, uh, wealth management is no very much required to retain the clients of the banks because they are on very much very much on demand. Uh, they they are no uh, they are very much on demand, and uh, if the banks are not getting into stepping into this segment of wealth management, most of the banks will be losing their high net worth individual customers. Uh, and uh, at any cost, it's imperative for the banks to retain the high, high net worth individuals and also to gain high net worth individuals to their food. So there comes the relevance of uh, wealth management. So uh, you have made it very structured so that we can learn it at, the, at, the very, uh, at, at ease, in a very easy manner. The only thing is that you need to dedicate uh, some fixed, fixed amount of time on a regular basis to get through. That's it. Right. And, uh, uh, you know, very easily because, uh, uh, I mean, the materials itself uh, will. And uh, what do you think once you completed this program, you know, the concepts yeah. that you have undergone, the concepts that you have learned in this program, how those concepts, you know, helped you to grow more professionally? So let's say in your day to day work, whatever you are doing in bank, you are dealing with client or you are in wealth management. Especially through the products of uh, uh, portfolio management system, mutual funds. Uh, equity funds and all that. So these so were all actually practically using all those in your uh, you know uh, day to day life. Yeah, this is in fact very helpful for me. Uh, any advice that you would like to give to people who are in the banking industry or maybe the young entrants, the young uh, people who want to join this industry? Any advice you want to give it to them so that they are also motivated in a short period of time. Uh, otherwise, what will happen is that. Um, I mean, in private sector as well as in the public sector space, what happens is that it is in a defined manner how you can grow. But uh, gaining this kinds of certification, specifically uh, CWM, CWMR from AFM Academy, will uh, take you uh, will make you grow in your career within a short period of time. So uh, it is uh, in fact imperative for you to do this course uh, and get certified from a very prestigious premier institute like AFM. They are the global leaders is what I understand. So get it certified from a very trustworthy uh, a pioneer organization. So uh, go for it soon and get certified and uh, get, a, get into a promising, very promising career. Thank you so much, Mr. Vimosh, for being so positive, for being so motivated, motivational, basically. And we're also thankful to you that you're a part of AFM family.